In October of 2016, I had the opportunity to take part in a Habitat for Humanity build event in celebration of Habitat's 40th anniversary. This event saw over 100 volunteers from around the world meet in Bacau, Romania and start the construction of 40 homes for 40 families in need. Romania is a beautiful country, rich in history and culture. However, of its 20.6 million people, 8.5 million have no access to running water, and half of the estimated 4 million children live in poverty. During the communist rule, from 1947 to 1989, thousands of inexpensive and poorly constructed apartments were built. These drab, grey and cramped apartments still serve as housing for the poor throughout the country. It is not uncommon for these dwellings to have communal washrooms. Part of the Habitat for Humanity experience is to visit the home of the beneficiary family and on this build, I had the opportunity to visit the Popa family. Marcus and Margarita are living in a family dorm with their children, Denisa and Stefan. All they have is one bedroom and a small kitchen and they all sleep in the same bed. There is only one bathroom which they share with 16 other families. To make the Popa's family situation even more dire is that Marcus is battling cancer. Visits to the beneficiary family's homes are always very humbling and inspiring experiences. These visits truly validate the Habitat for Humanity mission vision, which is a world where everybody has a decent place to live. when our home we're gonna we're gonna be finished and uh, we're gonna cook for you <laughs> all of you our traditional food meal and you're gonna want to remain here for the rest of your life <laughs> one word right now i would say hope <laughs> it's awesome all the way around I would say for me, life-giving. So if I had to give one word, I would say insight. Rewarding. Life-changing. Fulfilling. Mulțumim.
see nothing for miles and miles and miles. When I sleep in the evening, oh Lord, there she goes, only in dreams. She's only in dreams. No, no. 